Okay, on to the next skip the line reaction, man. And this one is Hua Shen Yu. It's the Mars concert, and it's called Light Bonfire at the End of the Milky Way, man. As you know, I absolutely love Hua Shen Yu, and this is for... Actually, I'll let you guess who this is for, right? <laughs> I'll let you guys guess who this Hua Shen Yu skip the line reaction is for. But for the person who has requested it, thank you very much. This is like your third or fourth one that you've requested. I really appreciate it. Thanks very much for supporting the channel as you always do. Obrigada. That might have given it away. Let's uh, rock and roll, man. Uh, light on fire at the end of the Milky Way. Who are you? Let's go. Hey, a beat. Hey. Hey. really like what he said there over there it's like we're talking about bigger picture over here right talking about the galaxies and the stars very hopeful type of um um song very uplifting so if the bad like i said on uh, um one of my other reactions i said there are very little artists that are able to sell what they are what they have right their product is singing their product is music and there are very little artists that are able to sell that with their performances. And I've named three artists that I think are one of the best at delivering that kind of thing. I mean, there's a couple of, of more, but actually I'm going to say four artists that I know straight off the bat that can absolutely deliver um, their, their, um, their art with conviction. And that is, you know, Laura Fabian, Dimash, Hua Shen Yu, and Tyler Joseph right in no specific order but they can just deliver that and i'm sure there's a lot of other artists but that was i was trying to my point that i was trying to make is it it literally just his demeanor his body language on stage already starts to paint a story and this whole story of that is like this bigger picture over here right it's like who would want to live on this earth it's like an island in the bigger picture the the the, the planets that's vast it's like it's we want to be exploring and it might be a metaphor for life in the sense of like why would you want to stay in one position all of the time right why do you want to stay on your little island all of the time you'll never learn anything it's time to go explore go out there so it's kind of like he's trying to paint the the galaxy as your canvas to go and learn stuff and and, and saying earth is your little island i'm not sure but that's kind of like what it's sounding like it's So this is giving me goosebumps. And look at that. He's just giving me goosebumps everywhere. And this is awesome. I love this artist so much. So much. And I love the meaning of this song. So he talks about sort of like mortality and immortality. And he talks about like when do we eventually, because human beings in our physical form, we mortals, like we eventually will die. But then when he says when we go to our immortal existence, right? And we float through the galaxy. At the end of the Milky Way, at the end of this galaxy, there will be a bonfire where we will where we will congregate again right we will congregate again in a beautiful um place right with filled with possibilities essentially so it's almost like he's giving 
he's giving infinity to your existence essentially so he's saying it's like it doesn't end here right it may be beautiful here right but even if it does end here you go into something even more beautiful and then at the end of that beautiful milky way and the galaxies and when we pass the comets and and the meteors and everything which will resemble every individual soul right we will all eventually congregate at the bonfire at the end of the milky way that's actually a beautiful way um, to speak about life beautiful oh, you're a woman. Hey, laugh. I love that. Is that how you say laugh in Chinese? Sauba? Is that how you say laugh? Sauba. Hey. I love the way this man delivers, man. Hey. Look how loose he is. Hey. Dramatic embraces are better than lonely journeys. What a beautiful line. This is so good though. Come on, dude. Don't hold on to stubbornness at old age. Let it go. Although humans orbit around other planets, I would rather drift after a comet. <laughs> momentum, 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 right? I would rather chase the next beautiful thing. Come on, man. <laughs> There's even like, there's a poppy element to it, and there's almost like a fo a folky element to it. Am I right in saying that, Frank? You let me know. You 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 better at uh, um, sort of uh, describing this and articulating this. Does this not have a bit of like a folky feel, even though it's got a bit of a poppy feel to it as well? It's very uplifting, but it's got I'd even say Irish folky. I don't know. It sounds folky to a certain degree, and that's why that's why it's got so much of that, or so much of that glee, and it's got so much of that um, spice in it. Do you know what I mean? Come on. <laughs> Who cares about choreography if you could just move your body and feel the music? Like, he's just feeling it, man. Like, he's just, these are involuntary movements, man. These are just, his body is just taking over, essentially. Right? There's nothing that's, that's planned and strategized and choreographed. He's just feeling it, man. And, that's, and this is what the song did take. Actually, a choreographed piece to this would kind of take away from it. It's a very light, very unshackled, type of track where you just you go where it takes you and there is no there are no rules to this right just do what you feel man that's what the sounds soundtrack that's what the soundtrack sounds like 
hearing in the background that is special that was one of my favorites of Hua Shen Yun and the majority of his stuff is my favorite but this over here man this was different it's put me in a good mood man this was just beautiful it was light there was there was nothing heavy about this it was all just it was a beautiful just story of um, galaxies and journeys and life uh, beyond our mortality it's just gorgeous what a beautiful beautiful analogy to life come on man beautiful piece love this loved 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 it. this completely has changed my mood today just by listening to this you guys let me know what you think down below i'll catch you in the next one